All right, Ryan, how we do today? What's up, guys? We did all right. Slow bottom uh, bottom bite today, but we got lucky and uh, had some mahi come up in the chump slick, and we got a few few to eat. Super early in the season. What's uh, a lot of you East Coast people, you're gonna be like, oh, these are peanuts. Yeah, little guys. Size limit is totally different on the West Coast because we don't get them very often. Yeah, there's no size limit. Very common to keep mahi this size. Don't judge us. We like mahi too. We don't get them as much as you guys. They're tasty. They are delicious. This was a bigger one. Obviously, we got these two other peanuts here. Yeah, this one's almost classified as uh, chicken noodle pair. That's what they call them. Really? It's certain sizes, yeah. And this one had some row, so I feel extra bad about that because there's about a million babies in there. Way to go, Ryan. That's what Bagus is. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I get blamed all of a Look at that play. Yeah. A little bit of skin on the other side. All right, guys, welcome back. We're doing uh, the mahi. We did good. We did the catch. Um, we're just doing mahi tacos, black mahi tacos with my wife's. <laughs> She's ran out of the camera. Right out of the camera. So it, it calls for uh, onion, red onion, green cabbage, red cabbage, pepper. No one doesn't want it. He wants a banana. You want a banana? Yeah. You can have a banana. <laughs> so that's our uh, coleslaw for the, for the tacos, and then we have one. This was just a peanut mahi. I think it's only half of it. To be honest, I forget. Was it a whole, the whole peanut? That might just be half of half of one of them. And then um, this is our blackening season. We got paprika, garlic powder, oregano, onion powder, pepper, salt, and garlic pepper. And time. So I'm gonna coat this in a little bit of olive oil, coat it in the blackened seasoning, and then cook it for about three or four minutes in that oil that's heating up right there. Oh. All right, so I put a little the flays in here with a little bit of olive oil, just getting it nice and minced. Why do you laugh, Ryan? <laughs> now I'm gonna toss it in this black and seasoning, all around a little bit. All right, add these in. This is the oil. There we go. Yeah, it's nice and hot. You need to move that oil around. Gravity kind of keeps it on the side. It's like little black and mahi fish sticks. Oh, pleasure starting. Right now. Smells good already. Cook these up about mm, probably three minutes. Three to four minutes aside, and then we're gonna throw some tacos together. So, another three minutes, we'll be putting them on our tacos. Sounds great. We also have a special gift for you guys. Ryan's gonna steer that. <laughs> we'll see. It's gonna be really as bad as people say. I ate a piece raw and it tastes like nothing. Literally nothing. It's like air. If I was starving, I would use it again. But we're gonna sear it up and see how it tastes. Boom. Oh. And there's your mahi taco. Mahi. As an addition to our mahi video. We got Paulette playing with whole cans. <laughs> <laughs> and we also have this, so, this is a slab. Uh, black bit of tuna. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm in Bonita. Yeah. So I just coated it up in some uh, sesame seeds, garlic powder, some garlic. Kind of like how you do some ahi tuna. And we're going to throw it on this hot skillet, sear it up, and uh, try a slice. Cook it for a few minutes aside. Probably, I might cook it a little longer than I would cook actual tuna. So 
here's our panita. Seared up. Hey, hey, baby, come here. We're gonna eat dinner, okay? So, you need to like, Looks like tuna. This knife isn't the best for it, but it's working. It's flicking like tuna. Oh, you want me to come back? Yeah. Well, why don't you go around and come here and I'll get you this way? It's the same flavor that tuna does. Yeah. Yes. So Tuna's I'm, a lot more flavorful. I like a little silly sauce on there. But it is good. Yeah. Like, I would eat that. Go play your sand. Can you go build something? Oh, I know. I love you. I would eat the rest of that. No problem. It's good. Yeah, it's not bad. That's really good. Yeah. Totally eat that. Are we gonna start eating bonita all the time? I think so. Yeah. I can't tell much of a difference. I mean, the tuna is definitely better. You could eat it totally raw. Yeah. This I wouldn't eat raw like you tried it the other day. But <clears throat> it's good. You guys should definitely try this at home. <laughs> like, like, I was gonna really cook this at like a, a party or something I was invited to. Yeah. <laughs> Just bring a bunch of bonita. I would. It's like our bonita getting tore up. Right I would now. totally sear it up. Okay, and eat that's it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Slow motion bite over there. I did it. I did it. How was it? Very good. Really good. It's definitely blackened, which is what you do when you blacken fish. You coat it and everything. Sear it up oh, real yeah. hot. Get it black. That's what makes it black. Mm -hmm. good. It's very good. We're gonna try a different recipe this weekend. Mm -hmm. Oh, you like the tacos?